Hi, this is Saev Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpisami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpisami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Welcome everybody. Uh, today, guys, we take a look at the euro currency again, since uh, it's really some patrons are forming right now, and uh, it looks really promising today. And probably we could get a really significant action, uh, as it right now stands on the daily chart on the intraday chart. It's probably to the downside. This market could reach as far as one or one or eight fifty area approximately. So today we also will get the information on the Fed Reserve, not just a decision on the rate. But also some uh, insights on the economy situation in the United States and assessment from the Federal Reserve. So this could shed some light on the perspective of the Fed policy uh, till the end of the year. Because although currently investors mostly disappointed and uh, do not expect the possible rate hiking due to the Brexit situation, but uh, as we have discussed in our vehicle research uh, that was dedicated to your currency a couple of weeks ago, that it's not as uh, bad as it seems right now. So, uh, in fact, uh, Fed really uh, could write the rate closer to the end of the year, probably maybe on even December uh, meeting. But this, uh, this really could happen. And uh, that's why the not re even the rate decision, but the, the overall uh, press conference the talks on the perspective of the economy, uh, it's more important right now. So, what we have on the daily chart? In the daily chart, guys, we mostly have discussed this appearing of the grabber. Uh, so last week we have talked about it taking the shorts position based on this pattern. And uh, so also market has dropped below the monthly pivot point and stands on the way down. But this action stands very slow. So you can see significant overlapping candles. Uh, non farm pearls really was here. This was high wave pattern, some kind of that sort. Market right now stands inside of range of this high wave since then. So yesterday market also has made another attempt to continue move high but again has failed and has formed another bearish grabber. As this grabber is that grabber both to suggest the further downward action. It's very probable uh, that the Fed comments will become the, the triggering uh, tr triggering issue that uh, will trigger the downward action here. So uh, minimum target as we said will be the below this loss. So this loss should be washed out and probably market uh, will reach one or nine on our 8.50 area. So uh, on the 4 hour time frame chart we have uh, interesting pattern. So take a look. After the 50% retracement that we have discussed, market has turned to some overlapping choppy, choppy action a bit. But st still it, it keeps chance well, valid for possible butterfly pattern. <clears throat> and particularly by, by this pattern probably if market really will start move action uh, to the downside, it probably particularly by this pattern will complete the targets. So it, 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 will, it will reach the target that we have specified on the daily chart. So this loss will be taken out but probably guys this very important range and uh, maybe some stops will be triggered below this area and that will add some more fuel to the downward action. That's why we can not exclude that market could reach as far as 1 or 850 area. It's complete this part of line. Uh, so uh, finally on the hourly chart guys we have interesting pattern is now forming. It's head and shoulders, reverse head and shoulders. Uh, so you can see after the butterfly has been completed, let's take a look, Mike has formed another pattern here. It's very harmonic. So you can see left shoulder, head, and right now Mark is forming the right shoulder. So we just would like to warn you that uh, don't rely on this pattern because it's very dangerous and it's really very high chance that this pattern will fail. Mostly due to the situation that we have on daily chart. On the daily we have two uh, bearish grabbers that suggest further drop. On the follow time frame chart, this could be the butterfly and market stands, as you can see, below the monthly period and below the weekly period. And that's why the chances on the completion of this butterfly and some ABCD retracement up is currently uh, less probable than the failure of this pattern and dropping, continuation dropping to the downside. So that's, an, uh, that's our opinion. Uh, that's why, guys, with the monitoring of these uh, hand and shoulders, we could use it as an indicator. So if market, for example, will fail to hold here and will drop in an area of the Head. This will just confirm that market 
will continue move lower. So you could use this hand shoulder dispatch as indicator as well, because this this is the moment when the market uh, let's call it uh, let's say uh, should take the decision. So if it will fail here, it will mean that overall hand shoulders will fail and market will continue move lower. If it will hold and will start to upward action, some thrusting action here, well, it's probably theoretically it's possible, but uh, currently I think that the chances on that is significantly less than um, the chances that the grabbers will start to work and the market will uh, drop a bit lower. So that being said, our suggestion here on the euro is that market probably will continue move lower and you should reach the area around uh, 1850, 109, so complete, uh, reach the next support area. In the daily chart, you can see this uh, monthly period support, one few level, and also this will be some kind of the butterfly, maybe completion point stands also in this area. Uh, but in, in, in the medium term perspective, we still work with this ABCD pattern, and market completed 100%, next target will be 1 or 6. And uh, in this way down could become the just the first part of the downward continuation right to the 106 area. That's why it seems very important now.